Today, I'm going to show you how to create a family crest or coat of arms. The coat of arms was originally developed in Europe to show knights in battle. They were used to tell one another apart. Over time, these coats of arms represented the family. A family crest is unique and recognizable in design, symbols, emblems, and with a motto or slogan which is a word or phrase that describes the family's purpose and what they represent. Think of your school logo or your favorite sports team logo. You can recognize them by the shapes and the colors used. In the coat of armors, colors, animals, symbols, and shapes all represent something special for the family, such as what's important for that family, their religion, who the members of the family are, and the jobs and roles they had. The coat of arms also represented the family's history. It showed where the family came from and how they came to be. For instance, the color red could signify love and the animal of a dragon could symbolize protection. Another example could be the lion representing being brave and that being very important for the family and the crown could represent royalty. What are the experiences that your family has? What is important to your family? With this in mind, think about the shapes, colors, symbols, animals that represent the special qualities about your family. For this project, you will need a large piece of paper and crayons or markers you can start by drawing a shape of your family crest. It could be any shape you want. You can go online and look up shapes or you can just make one up um, and decide on a shape together as a family. At the top of your family crest, write the surname or last name of your family. How many members are in your family? Divide up your shield by how many people there are in your family. I have seven people in my family, so I divided up my family crest into seven parts. Have each member of the family choose a section of the crest. For each member of the family, choose their favorite color or a color that they like and color in that section. How do you help your family? Each member of the family can draw in their section symbols, words, or pictures that represent how they help the family out. What is something that makes your family special? Have each family member draw words, symbols, or shapes that represent what makes their family special. What is your family traditions or the history of your family? For this part, you can find family photos and cut them out and glue them on your family crest. Or maybe you could draw uh, the traditions of your family. Traditions are the beliefs or actions that we practice with our family um, regularly or yearly. These could be things like picking out a Christmas tree or lighting the menorah or gathering for dinner with your extended family. What is something you hope for in the future for your family? Have each member of the family draw or write words to represent the hopes and dreams that you have for yourself and for your family.